What is up everyone, how are you all doing this morning, noon or night, wherever it is that you are? So first of all I'm going to apologise for the tone of my voice, I am recording this in not early early mornings, but it's not noon, if that makes any sense. But we are going to be discussing the three, one per video, depending on how long they are. Um, three times money events going on this week being stockpile top fun and air force zero so what i'm just going to do all three in one because two of them th then there's not enough information to make an entire video about it so we're going to start off with the two simple ones top fun classic easiest of the three but it pays nearish nothing basically you've got one half of the lobby in jets, the other half on bikes or cars I think and you've basically just got to get from the starting spawn location to whatever destination is set onto your waypoint with the jets trying to blow you up. You don't get any lives, that's it, when you die you die, that's it. And that's basically it, you've just got to go from one point to another while having jets shoot at you. So. That's pretty much it. It's a classic, so if you enjoyed it on 360 or PS3, you're going to love it. Next is Air Force Zero, where, again, similar thing, you've got actually three teams. You've got an, a defender that works with Air Force Zero, and then you've got an attacker. So the attacker is invisible to the defenders and... Air Force Zero's radar until he comes close enough. The attacker will always be able to see the Air Force Zero plane. The defenders, like I said, will not be able to see the attacker until he comes close enough. So you got to keep your eyes peeled. Don't know if it happens when you're high altitude. So I'd suggest if you're the attacker, go high altitude until you're at a comfortable spot where you can nosedive take them out especially if you're own because you want to maintain invisibility as long as possible so you want to go up to a high altitude so you don't get spotted but the main three times money this week is the fun one it is stockpile now this consists of both teams or four teams collecting flags um, from a center point where every team will be going to and taking it back to your zone you have to get 13 to your zone to be able to win so you've got to get all 13 that doesn't mean that I'll get go back and forth 13 times picking one up and that's it no you've got to get every single flag on the map into your zone so if I'm getting 12 going back and putting another ones in that you've already got no you've got to get all 13 now where this works is you do not <coughs> want to get all 13 don't get all 13 get about 10 and just let the timer run down because the only way and I have experienced this last night and boy was I getting frustrated do not do four teams do not do it any less than 15 minutes. Let me explain. So, <clears throat> first of all, four teams is a pain in the ass because you only get about three or four people per team and it's annoying. So do two teams, two big teams, it's much more fun. Second, don't get all 13 because if you get all 13 and you've only been going for about five minutes, you're only going to get about seven grand which is not worth it so you want to get as many as possible and if you want to do this tactic you need to get yourself a flag and just fly around so your team don't put it in and end it because as soon as the 13th flag gets into your zone that's it you're done two rounds you're going to do two rounds but you want to do it for 15 minutes because if you go for the full 15 minutes and win at sixty thousand dollars for one round so you do this twice in a row whatever is 
sixty thousand dollars times two is, which I can't do it at the moment in this early in the morning, but I will put it on the screen. Um, that's what you will get. Now, if you have, you know, you got sixteen friends, you all clam on there together. You do one team win one. It, te it normally it's purple and orange when it's two teams only. So you got sixteen friends. Purple team wins. Orange team wins. Unfortunately, because it's two two rounds, one of you is going to have to lose. So purple team wins, orange team wins, purple team wins, and then you do it again. Orange team wins, purple team wins, orange team wins. This will make it so you get three times sixty thousand dollars. No, not really, because you're losing. Um, I can't. I think it's twenty. F I can't remember how much second place gets or the second team gets, but you want to get. 60 grand each time. So just to recap on that. Do it for 15 minutes. 10 is alright. Because 15 minutes you get $60,000. Um, 10 minutes you get $40,000. So I'm assuming. Going by that. 5 minutes you'd get $20,000. So 5 minutes is okay. But trust me. You're going to be having so much fun. With this, you're gonna ha you you might as well do it on 15 minutes because you just want to gonna keep going because it is so fun, it really is. Be it do it for 15 minutes, let the timer run out all the way through. Just make sure you have more flags than the other team if you are planning to win. If you want to win the full amount, you need to make sure you've got more flags. So, like I said, get most of the flags, and if need be, if you've got 11. Make sure you get that last, no, if you've got 12 anyway, make sure you get that last 13 flag and just fly around. All you've got to do is just shoot other players out of the sky, that's it. That's literally all you've got to do. Um, the vehicles is the the pyro, which is a good one. It's the, there's another one, it has a, it's got like a funny nose to the plane. Spitfires, helicopters all different types of weapons on it. The helicopter has a barrage. Most of the jets have um, rockets, homing ones. The Spitfires have got explosive MGs. It's all very different. So the helicopter one isn't as bad as it seems. So it's not. Act it's actually quite good. It's a small ground, and it's not actually that bad. I I thought it was going to be horrible, but it's really not. Um, but that this is just the most fun you will ever have and it's so worth it because I did two rounds no well I did two matches four rounds in total and I got I think I had a little bit of money in my pocket anyway already but I got by the end of it I think four hundred and eighty thousand dollars in a far less time than last week's contact missions um, last week's contact missions money so this is definitely better it's more fun so hopefully that was useful to you um, like I said get a flag from the start and just hold on to it basically um, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did think this was helpful and did enjoy, then please leave a like, leave a comment if you have any tactics yourselves or strategies that you do to it, what you think is the best vehicle for it, being the pyro, spitfires, or the helicopters. Basically, as the week goes on, you'll be able to see the different vehicles. And obviously, if you did enjoy, then please subscribe and not to forget to click the notification bell to be notified on any videos and updates I unleash onto the channel and I will see you all in the next one. Thank you for watching.